hairstyle that first became popular in the 80s is making a comeback and a difference. You know, business in the front, party in the back. The USA Mullet Championship is an online competition where people across the country compete for who has the best mullet, all while supporting a good cause. This month, the winners were announced and the top 25 included a mid-Missouri mullet. In tonight's MVP, I'll introduce you to the 12-year-old finalist from Montgomery County. A uh, baseball trophy. This baseball champ has a new trophy he's hoping to add to his collection. National Mullet Champion. And 12-year-old Chase and Sachs hopes this hairdo helps him win. I have a goal to come like top 10 for the next competition, possibly first. This month, he got close to that goal, placing 13th in the country in the kids category out of over 1,000 online entries. I was the only person in the top 25. Um, that was in Missouri, so I have the best mullet in Missouri. I'll claim that. Took me a long time to like my curls, so if he likes his hair and is doing something fun with it, then I'm proud of him. His mom says the idea grew out of the pandemic. It was quarantine and we didn't have a chance to get haircuts, so we decided to just have some fun with his hair and I let him um, start a mullet and I had no idea it would grow into this. Jason says he got his inspiration from his favorite sport. Before COVID happened, um, I was a big fan of the Cardinals and my favorite player was Harrison Bader. He even perms his hair to match Bader's curls. My mom spent a lot of money when I was that age trying to get my hair straight because I didn't like my curls. So in a weird twist of fate, I'm now paying for perms for him. <laughs> From there, it's grown into a family favorite. His sisters are two of his biggest fans. I think it's cool. I like how it has curls. Not only did Chasen place in the top 25 this year, but his hair is helping others. And um, this year we managed to raise up over 100,000. 100% of donations to the competition go to Homes for Wounded Warriors. The organization helps build accessible homes for injured veterans. It was really nice to be able to um, to partner with something like that and make it bigger than just hair also. There's a vote for Jason Smollett. Jason has even campaigned for support, handing out business cards at fairs and restaurants. Well, so just seeing that confidence in him doing things that most adults would be afraid to do. He's hoping next year he hits a home run as a USA mullet champ. But even if he strikes out, his family says he's still a cut above the rest outgoing personality. He's a really kind kid. I'm super proud of him. <laughs> well, Jason says he doesn't plan on cutting his hair anytime soon and is fully committed to winning next year in the teenage division when he turns 13.